know. See, th see, this is what I'm talking about. Can, can we just get more stuff like this? Great quality, great color stories. I mean, honestly, can, can we just get more stuff like this? Thank you. welcome on back to my channel so today as you can already see I am playing with ColourPop's new palette Lush Life and I'm giving you three looks okay so but before we get started let me go ahead and introduce myself if you are new to my channel welcome and if you're oldie but goodie welcome on back my name is Ashley I have a doctorate in pharmacy and I love makeup Yes, I love makeup, so that's how you get Dr. Ash in her makeup, and eyeshadow really is my jam, but please just call me Ash or Ashley. So like I just mentioned, we are playing with the ColourPop Lush Life palette, and oh my gosh, it's so stunning. It's a 12-pan palette, and it has a beautiful color story. It's very vibrant, very bright, puts me in the mood for summer for sure. And I also picked this set up, well, this palette up along with these pencils and these are the great these are the wonderful what is it the cream gel liners that everybody loves and they came out it looks like i wouldn't say these are brand new colors and i actually picked this up in a set where the palette retails originally for 18 dollars, and i want to say this is about 18 as well but in the set together i got it for 34 and of course there's so many discount codes coupon codes running out there for color pop i mean you can't really lose and open this palette up you get 12 beautiful shades and you get six really fun shimmer shades along with the rest being just really beautiful mattes you get some really bold vibrant mattes right here with the shades monsoon and on the prow and the palette is like i said before it's just gorgeous of course color pop is out of the united states and this palette is manufactured in california and distributed by color pop cosmetics the packaging is recyclable and color pop is cruelty free now for the liners they did come in these little boxes right here and it was three liners where two appear to be metallic and the other one is just more of a standard green so we have the shade canopy and then we also have the shade of flow, a glow, excuse me. And then we also have two can do it, which is such the cutest name right here. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to give you three looks and then we're going to wrap up with some final thoughts at the end. All right, let's go ahead and get started with these eye looks. The eyebrows are filled in using my Goof Proof Pencil, shade 3.75. Then I went ahead for primer with my Juvia's Place Eye Prep Eye Prime.
back and here are the first two looks and oh my gosh I love them this one is giving me all the tropical vibes and this one is like I don't know it's like a <laughs> I don't even know it's just golden it's green it's giving me all the vibes and this pencil oh my gosh it went on so great so this is the pencil that came with it this is the one and let's see let's see uh, two can do it <laughs> which is a really really cute name and I don't normally go for pencils like this so I'm really happy and then the pencil that I have on this eye is actually this one which is the darker green one and it is called uh, canopy and everything performs so well everything blended out very well the shimmers are great some are more satin like the shimmer that I, this orange shimmer right here which is the shade called hotness it's very beautiful the mattes perform very well um juicy is really pretty it's it's paradise wildlife um and so it's hideaway and i've had like just a good time playing with this and everything performs so well so let's go ahead and jump into one more look oh and my face details is nothing new it'll be down below in the description box And this is the third look and ooh, it's so pretty I'm really digging it so for this look I went ahead and used the last pencil in the set and this is a glow so let's go ahead and jump into some thoughts about the palette I mean they knocked it out the park with, with this one I when I saw it I was like yes I need to have it it is colorful it is a vibe I'm here for the mattes I'm here for the shimmers and it's just beautifully done when you look at the packaging you just feel happy it's nice it's compact i like how lush it's just embossed and so is the life part just a little bit smaller and it just feels really great it kind of has like a velveting feel to the um cardboard and the packaging was just carried out nicely even with the liners i'm really glad that i got the set because you know ColourPop with these liners a lot of people enjoy them but they bring them back they take them away they bring them back they take them away you can never buy the full set with just all the liners in them and a lot of people like these liners and they are really good i was really pleasantly surprised at this yellow one i didn't think i was going to like it i don't typically go for bright water lines like that but i really liked it and i think that pairing it with some shadow down below just really kind of helped that i usually don't put shadow down below you guys probably notice that because sometimes it just kind of closes off my eyes but with these particular bright liners it just kind of does the same so this one's had a metallic effect to it also that's what's here and then of course the golden and then the great this standard kelly green that 
smooth. I think it's just so beautiful. But the palette performance was excellent. Uh, the shimmers, they were really nice and buttery and creamy, opulent. I didn't have to wet anything. I didn't have a problem building anything up. I, you probably just saw me go in with Juicy just a little bit more only because it was just a little bit brighter green than I was anticipating. So I thought it was going to come off more true to color here, but it it, it just kind of changed colors on me. I don't think it's a bad shade. I do really like it. All the mattes perform so well. I feel like that Monsoon is probably my favorite out of the bunch. I feel like it's the most pigmented. Of course, because it's a blue, when you start blending away, it did fade. But you just go back in and intensify. And usually you have to do that with really colorful mattes. On the Prowl, it's really pretty as well. And then you have some great transition shades here. So you have something, if you're of lighter skin tone, deeper, definitely mid-range. And then you also have this brown. So you get the rose golds that, you know, like ColourPop is going to throw in there, but it's really pretty. And then I feel like I really prefer like hotness over this one. I feel like this is really pretty, but I have it across my collection several times over. Uh, wildlife and this um, golden, the olive golden shape. It's paradise or beautiful. And so it's pom pom. And that's what I have across my lid. I feel like this is a gorgeous palette. It's $18. The so quality is impeccable. Like, Yes, ColourPop. This is what I want to see from you. None of that. I don't know what you've been doing this year, <laughs> to be honest. I'm like, mm. this is the first release that I bought from ColourPop this year because I do have, what is it, the Wow Free palette. But did that come out this year or did that come out in December? I purchased it this year, but I feel like as far as new releases, this is the first one. I haven't been interested in anything and I feel like because a lot of times ColourPop just repeats itself and it just they put out so much stuff and it's just like I can't even keep up but this collection is gorgeous and I really love the liners I think it's a great value and it's just nice fun pops of color if you want color you want a little bit of brown to kind of face your look in it you can definitely create that if you want a little bit of boldness you got that with this palette as well it's affordable the palette alone is $18 I did opt to get the liner in that set it was a $39 value but I got it for $34 of course there's so many codes out there for the color pop so um, overall I really enjoy the performance of the palette it's actually really really good it's one of the best I kind of put it up there with like the good sports the whatever palette the baroque palette um, yeah I'm trying to think <laughs> they it the performance is really really great on that palette it was just so easy to work with and it really felt high-end and at this point in the game because ColourPop has their own lab there they should always be putting out some quality type of products but I think a lot of times they fall in the trap of just getting out stuff so fast but I love these looks oh my gosh so mm. Which one do I like the best is the question. So I think I'm going to go with look number one was actually my favorite. And that's so weird because, you know, I don't always like my first look the most. And then this is my second favorite. And then the third look, which my third favorite is the second look I did. So, yeah, I'm going to go with that. But all the looks that were just really, really beautiful stunning so let me know down in the comments what was your favorite look have you picked up this palette are you interested i think if you're interested and ColourPop runs a little sale or whatever and you're in the market to shop on ColourPop, i would definitely pick this up so go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up hit the notification bell so you know when i come out with another video which will be very very soon and please subscribe to my channel because you know i would love to have you here in my little makeup family and with all of that being said you already know what time it is it's time for the Chaddies. Hey, 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 Chaddies. Mm, mm, Chaddies. Mm, 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 Chaddies. Mm, mm, Chaddies. Mm, mm, Chaddies. Mm, mm, Chaddies. Mm, mm, Cha